clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, and your life will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, stop your feet. If you're happy and you know it, stop your feet. If you're happy and you know it, and your life will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, stop your feet. If you're happy and you know it, say amen. 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 If you're happy and you know it, say amen. 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 If you're happy and you know it, and your life is surely showed. If you're happy and you know it, say amen. Amen. If you're happy and you know it, do all three. Amen. amen. If you're happy and you know it, do all three. Amen. amen. If you're happy and you know it, and your life is surely showed. If you're happy and you know it, do all three. Amen. Clap your hands for Jesus. Come on. That's the only solo Uncle Mark will let me sing. I'm just saying. Everybody always wants a gift that they don't have. I wish I could. I would sing everywhere. They would say, they would say good morning, Greg. I'd be like, good morning. God gave us each a gift, right? Amen? Amen. And enjoy your own gift. Every head bow. Heavenly Father, I love being here every morning on Sunday morning to meet with you with our family together. I thank you. It's nothing like this. There's, there's nothing else I can do that makes me feel like being in your presence, Lord, and with our family together. I thank you, Lord. You have brought us. We were thinking about this earlier. You brought us such a long way, Lord. I thank you. You never faltered. You've been along with us for this whole entire trip. Lord, we love you and we thank you. How could we not say thanks? How could we not give you praise for all when we look at all that you have done? How could we not open our mouths and say thank you and say hallelujah and say how great and awesome is our Father and great and mighty are your works and you are holy and you are worthy and you are above all and you have created everything and you sustain us, Lord God, and you provide for us, oh God, I thank you, I thank you, just to be together with my family in our presence of my brethren so, and my sisters so that we could say thank you, Lord. And we say all this in the mighty name of Jesus, and the church says amen. 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 Just wanna, I want to just start off by reminding us to pray for our brother Ray. He had a heart attack, right? And he, they put a stent in and they found some other blood clot or areas. So he's there in the hospital at Geisinger. I'm thankful that the Lord, Amen. his grace and his mercy has been over. Is that Evan? Is that Evan? Yeah. Evan? Yeah. So, yeah. so we're, we're glad for God's yeah. mercy and grace. Any update? Do you have news? No. Simone? He's just going to get a second procedure done on Tuesday. He's going to get a second procedure done. So you know Brother Ray, he was all about inviting kids to summer camp the last few days. People calling me up from Oakland Elementary School. This some guy dropped off flyers to give to all the kids. We just don't have enough for all the kids, so we can't hand out. But he just really would have been a blessing in the skate park and everywhere this week. So let's keep him up in prayer. And we already let Seema know if she needs anything or he needs anything to let us know. We're here. We're a family, right? Amen. Amen. So let's, let's just, Father God, right now, we thank you for your grace and your mercy spare in our brother Ray's life, God, and we anticipate that you'll use even this for your glory and your honor. So, Lord, we just ask that you would reach out with your powerful healing hand and touch him. Now, God, help him to know that your presence is there, God. Open up every blockage, God, in the name of Jesus. Help him to find out everything they need to find out today. And, God, I just pray for him to be quickly on the men and back in the fellowship together with the people of God, doing what he's doing, inviting people to come and meet a God who, who saves and who heals and who delivers. So I thank you. I praise you. Hold up his family while he goes through this. But God, we thank you that you'll go through it with them. And it's in the mighty name of Jesus we pray. Amen. 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 Donnie was back in the hospital yesterday with stomach pains, and they were going to do a uh, scan yesterday, but I haven't yeah. heard anything okay. from him. Okay, all right. All right, I'm going to pray for yeah, that pray one. For Come Donnie. on. Heavenly Father, right now, we pray for Donnie. We pray yeah. for Ray. We pray for all those who are sick among us, Lord God. We pray that you would do what only you can do, oh God. We pray that you would give wisdom to the doctors and the nurses. Lord God, we pray that you would help their bodies to go back and function how they're supposed to function. Every cell, every fiber, every part of our body, Lord, we submit it to you. 
Our faith is not in the hospitals. Our faith is in you, O oh God. We continue to trust you, O oh Lord, and we ask for your help, Lord. When we are sick, we have no other remedy, Lord. So we ask you to come in and help. Yeah. And Lord, we ask that we as their, the people who support them would be anxious for nothing. But every time we get ready to worry, we would say a prayer, oh Lord. Yeah. Help us not to go towards worry, but to go towards prayer. Yeah. Lord, so we pray and we lift up, Lord. You are a God who heals. You are a God who strengthened. You are a God who spoke and rose the dead. You made blind people see. You opened up deaf ears. There is yeah. nothing that is too hard for you. You yeah. can save our eternal soul. How much easier is it to save these bodies, oh God? Mm -hmm. So we submit and we put our trust in you, Lord, for our brothers who would be here, and our, those who are members, Lord God, who would be here. We ask that you would comfort them. Yeah. Let them know that you're right there. They said, where is God? God is right there, right there. as you're yeah. going through that yeah. struggle, Lord. So we pray for our brothers that we love, our brother Ray and our brother Donnie, that you will be yeah. with them right yeah. now. Heal their bodies. By faith, we believe, Lord God, and we ask you to do the rest. In Jesus' name, amen. 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 We got a scripture in Ephesians. We took a little break. Remember Ephesians 1, but who we are in Christ. Who are we? We're chosen. We're redeemed. Everybody say redeemed. Redeemed. We're forgiven. He chose you before you were born. That's a miracle. And he chose you before you were born because if he waited for you to show up and act the way you act, he would have never chose you. Amen? Amen. 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 Right? And then Ephesians told us who we once were. Boy, I'm glad somebody could bring up what they want about my past, but that's not who I am today. So I, can't have church. I don't live like that. That's not who I am. Say what you want. That was a different person. I'm a new life in Christ. Amen. 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 Then Ephesians 3, we get to Apostle Paul, starts out with, I'm a prisoner of Christ. He lets you know where, where his heart is for today. And then Ephesians 4, he also we talked about our gifts, right? And how we could use that for the building of the kingdom. Amen. And now we get to Ephesians chapter 5. And I have my daughter read Ephesians 5, nice loud voice. Therefore, be imitators of God as beloved children and walk in love. A little bit louder, like you yelling at your sister or your brother. <laughs> Therefore, be imitators of God as beloved children and walk in love. And say amen, amen, church. Amen. amen. Go ahead, amen. clap your hands. For the of God. <laughs> when someone tells me my dad's been gone a long time, when someone says, oh, you remind me of your dad, it's the greatest compliment that you could give me, amen. right? My dad was tougher than me. I'm not half as tough. My dad, and he loved God more than more than I did. Oh, yeah. I did so much stuff that I copied from him. I didn't even realize I was copying. Sometimes how I walk and how I talk. We live in a world where everybody wants to be an, an original, an original thing. But let me tell you, we are copies of people who have lived before us. It's true. It's true. And now we have a chance to copy our Lord and our Amen. Savior Jesus Amen. Christ. Amen. That's a good word. That's a good word. somebody don't imitate Bill Gates nothing no, I'm, not, I'm not saying anything personal about him don't imitate a president don't imitate a great teacher you want to copy somebody's life you want to be like somebody that you saw be like God by showing love to each other say amen church I want to be like God so how can I copy God by showing love that's and right. it's not easy. That's why it's love. Sure. Say amen, church. Amen. And the Bible says if you only love the people that love you, right. you're just like a sinner anyway. Right. Come on. Right. I specialize in loving the easy people. But what about those who give you a hard time? Say amen. 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 What about those that you just want to, oh, let me yeah. pray. Pray. You just want to pray for them. Yeah. He said you want to imitate and be yeah. like God. That is part of your divine. When you're when you're showing love, you are acting in a divine nature. That's you true. are not acting like this Adam body that we have. Amen. You want to copy something? Don't copy the world's way of thinking. Don't copy the way's world of living. Don't copy anything from the world. Copy something from your father. 
imitate by showing love today. 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 Amen. Amen. Imitate your father by showing love. And that'd be a wonderful way for somebody to be like, you are just like your dad. Yes. You're just like your daddy. Amen. I show him. Amen. 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 I'm glad to be here. I, I tell you, this is the greatest mm. way to start our week and to be together. Yeah. Amen. To get charged Amen. up and to make it through. Amen. 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 Head bows. Thank you, Lord. We love you, Lord. I thank you for this for this day. I thank you for this opportunity to be in your presence, Lord. Mm -hmm. The word says that in your presence is the fullness of joy, mm -hmm. Lord. There's nobody like you, Lord. There's nobody who kept all their promises and have been a faithful friend and has every resource at their disposal, Lord God. We thank you. Help us to be more like our daddy. Help us to be more more imitators of you. Help us to, to shun the way the world lives and the way the world acts and the way the world treats people and the way the world thinks. Help us to be more like you, Lord, by showing love to each other. We will imitate the divine nature, Lord God, that is inside of us. Help us to love. They will know that they were Christians by their love. So Lord, we love you and we thank you for this day. And we ask that you would bless us in the mighty name of Jesus. And the church says, Amen. Amen.